Ah, what is the best internet plan for gaming? Come on. Console, PC, phone. Don't game on. Well, I mean, no, I'm gaming on phone's pretty cool. These phones are super, super supreme. But which one's the best one for gaming? Okay. So is the 5,000 by 5,000 your best bet? Uh, you got the money for that $250 a month program, go ahead and do it, but you're not going to get anything out of it except give that company more money, and they're doing just fine. So, most of you, like me, live in an apartment or a home, and uh, new homes do not have what they call back feeding of Cat5 Ethernet. They don't have any cables anywhere, so you're installing this modem in, like, next to the garage or in a closet somewhere that's on the other side of the house. So you're going to get a mesh system with if you can afford it, because um, they're expensive, but 10, 10 bucks a month with AT&T. So, which is the best? Um, 5,000 by 5,000 can give you the most bandwidth, but your ping levels are gonna stay consistently the same at about three to seven millisecond pings, whether you're on the 50 program or the 5,000 program. So your speeds are optimal with fiber. Uh, Copper is a little bit different. You're going to range uh, speeds of 25 to 32 millisecond pings um, and up to speeds of 100 by 20. Um, now, even on the copper side, 100 by 20 is not the best. 75 by 20 is going to be a better one because that's you'll you actually see the, the rest of it. But we're talking AT&T fiber for right now, so we'll skip all that. Now, <clears throat> $250 a month for the 5,000 by 5,000. I think it's uh, 175 for the 22,000 and about $80 a month for the 1,000. Um, back to the placement. So if this is in the living room and you have an ethernet connection to it, uh, you're gonna take advantage of the speeds out of it. Now, console gaming, PlayStation and, and Xbox, ethernet is gonna cap out between 300 and 750 megabytes a second. Uh, Wi-Fi, you're gonna probably hit 25 to 75 to 100 max. Now, if these gateways <clears throat> are in the other side of the house, then Wi-Fi is gonna be best bet unless you run you know, an Ethernet cord or straight across the floor. So the best AT&T plan, straight up, is 300 by 300. That's gonna give you plenty of bandwidth for the entire house for everything you got going on. Now, if you got 85 devices, go to you, you, you probably got a lot more than I do, um, <clears throat> or most of us do. But on a serious note, 300 by 300 is getting, gonna give you the best for anything you got. Um, you can Wi-Fi everything, you can stream, you can put security cameras up. It's gonna be fast, clean, and it's gonna save you some bucks too. So my two cents on that right there is 300 by 300 is gonna give, give you the best and it's quick enough for console gaming or pc gaming so thank you guys for coming to this channel we'll see you next time